Good evening everyone. This is Henry and in tonight's free video I wanted to share a couple swing based ideas with you. We've got a few names that I've been covering uh, that I like looking at on a daily basis that are in squeezes. I've covered a lot of them in previous videos but for tonight let's look at Baba, Google, and then probably Apple because that's such an important market metric. But when I look at Alibaba, I think that this is a pretty good case of a pattern that continues to make higher highs and higher lows. And even today's with the market strength was really just retracing back up into those moving averages. So I like the idea of probably playing it a little safer, you know, just for my personal taste. You could always go directional with it, but at least if you were going to choose the 18 day out options, maybe looking at a vertical. So doing something like the 165, 155 put debit spread would give you a chance to play that back down into the lows. And then if that squeeze fires to the short side, well then things really start to get interesting. A couple other names that I'm interested in buying, let's start with Google, where the next thing to start thinking about with Google is their next earnings run. So maybe I'm a couple of days early for this, but you know, time has a way of sneaking up on you sometimes. <laughs> so these are on the 25th and Today's the first, so uh, two weeks prior, three weeks, three weeks prior to the report, thinking about the increase in implied volatility in these options, and especially if you can get lucky and catch a squeeze. Now consider scaling in, because like back here, squeeze was a little odd, right? Kind of fire to the downside, but uh, ended up giving you a nice pop to the upside. Google last, their run into earnings was really solid. So, you know, give yourself some room to work. Maybe we're not quite into this tomorrow, but give it time into earnings. And I think you start maybe trying to buy it off that squeeze. And then Apple, where any pullbacks in this are a buying opportunity. I have been looking at the idea of establishing butterflies to the upside. I think maybe the most important thing I might be able to offer is that if you had a pullback, like what you saw previously, just this little three-day decline, if that were to happen again, that would take the stock all the way back down into about 224, and that's going to be a great buying opportunity. So regardless of what you read, if these technical levels hold, I think you continue to pursue these for higher prices, and I hope you find that helpful in your trading. One other thing I wanted to let you know about John will be having his Pinpoint Profits webinar tomorrow, October 2nd at 7 p.m. Central Time. I feel like John has always had a very good way, or one thing I've been very fortunate to learn from him, is how you can, if you can pick the right delta in a strategy, especially directionally at the right time, how helpful that can be in growing a small account. It's part of the whole reason why we trade options directionally as opposed to just trading stock. So he's going to be going over some of these strategies he's been using lately to help really emphasize these topics. I'm looking forward to it and I hope to see you there. So you guys have a great night and we'll talk to you then.